Courtney, that's right. Well, this happened around 6.30 last night. Police say 56-year-old Vaughn Blassingame started firing shots outside of Ashwood Apartments right on Casey Avenue. He's now charged with having weapons under disability and discharging firearms. And we do want to note the residents that we spoke with today did not wish to show their faces on camera because they say they're still scared. I was asleep, and then I had woke up, mm -hmm. and I just seen, it was like maybe 15 cop cars, you know, I never knew what it was about. According to court documents, Blasting Game was seen firing a 9mm handgun outside of this apartment building. Police say this is not his first offense. He has a prior conviction for felonious assault. I just saw like all the police officers and one of them had like a, um, a big gun and then he had a rifle and then another one came with like the little shield and I was on the phone with my mama and my sister like Y'all see this? I talked to another resident through social media. They tell me her daughter heard something hit her window and they heard multiple gunshots. That situation surprised me yesterday because this area right here is not like that. From where I'm from, I'm from downtown, so you know. Mm -hmm. And that took me by storm, so. Mm -hmm. But you know, at the end of the day, it's like scattered sites. Mm -hmm. It's everywhere. Yeah. It's everywhere. It could be in your backyard one day. You never know. Yeah. Look what happened to the football player. You know, you would never, you would never think something like that would happen. Residents say they're still scared more than 24 hours later. It just makes me scared because I got a son and he's a black boy, so it makes me scared. Like, I never want him to be in that type of lifestyle and I do everything I can to keep him out of it. Parents not knowing where to turn. You know, I got kids, as you see. I, what can we do? Yeah. To even protect my babies. What can I do to protect my babies? I don't have no gun license. But everybody around me got them. And begging the community to put down the guns. As far as the gun violence and this and the third, I'm sick of it. It's, it's just trifling. So Blasting Game will appear in court tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock for his arraignment. And of course, we are staying on top of this. As soon as we get some new developments, we'll be sure to bring you guys the latest. Courtney.